thought these things. I'll offer these things. But I imagine Abel's offering wasn't so good. Probably didn't have any hemp in that day, so he must have had a grapevine wrapped around that little old lamb's neck, laid it up there and laid it up on the rock. He didn't have a lance or a knife in the answer. He must have took a, a piece of rock, pulled its little head back and began to chop its little neck. And as it began to blink and kick and the blood going all over him, bleeding, bleeding, dying on the rock, yes. what did it represent? Four thousand years later, the Lamb of God hacked to death on the rock of ages, bleeding, bleeding, speaking in tongues as he was dying on Calvary. Oh, dear dying Lamb, thy precious blood shall never lose its power. For all the ransomed church of God be saved to sin no more. Our educational programs, denominational programs will mean not that. It'll take the blood of Jesus Christ and nothing else to do it. Yes, 